Good evening, friendo. It's time for Quest for Semi-Glory. We're doing a little extra stream today since we missed uh, yesterday's Shmup Book Club. Uh, we're going to do something silly today. We're going to do a solo 2x uh, Link to the Past multi-world. We're going to be playing two games. Not necessarily simultaneously, but more or less at the same time. Um, one with Luigi and one with Mario. Um, and they'll share items between the two of them. Which is real neat and cool and the Kind of amazing what we can do in the year of our Lord 2021. Oh, but oh boy. We're gonna see how poorly this goes, because usually we're pretty good at knocking out a seed, you know, two, two and a half hours or whatever. But with two of them mixed together like this, it can really, uh, can really be a drag sometimes. Or it can be really fast, depending on how lucky we get. So, <laughs> let's get this going in three. Oh, well, I guess we're just going. Never mind, I don't have to count down on this one. <laughs> good job. What a good start. Oof. Eat a Ganon's Tower already. I don't necessarily like that. Oops, I think I forgot to connect something here. Uh, hold on a second. I think I might have effed up my tracker a little bit? I don't know. Not 100% sure. We're gonna... So that should have kicked me a key. Oh no, it did. That was Ganon's tower key. Okay, I forgot to connect my second tracker though, so we're gonna do that quickly. There we go. All right, never mind. I'll start. Let's go. It's a Ganon's tower small key. I, I was I thought it was a Hyrule Castle small key, so I thought it had ticked up the wrong one. But anyways, we're playing Key Sanity on both of these, as well as uh, Enemy Rando, Full Boss Shuffle, Crystal Rando. Um, I have it set up to be equal chance of zero through four crystals for both the tower and um, uh, and to be able to kill Ganon on both seeds. So I'm hoping it's gonna roll lower. Like that'd be good if it did. Um, but we won't see it roll any higher than a four, which is uh, which is good and fine. Like usually lower crystal counts. Oh, wow, a sword, incredible. Usually lower crystal counts are just kind of, kind of make the routing a little bit more interesting. <laughs> You're not supposed to get everything all at once. You don't have to get all the crystals all the time, which is nice. I guess we'll just do front of the escape right away. So because this is multi-world, we're going to have to swap back and forth between these two games probably pretty frequently. Um, but we'll end up doing it at least from the start doing all the stuff we can access in one game and then swapping over doing all the stuff we can access in the other. Jeez, oh, there's some dangerous enemies in the first hallway. <laughs> Oof. And we'll see like what enemy rando does to us as well. Um, oh god. Weirdo fucking... I forget what these dudes are called. Engators or something. Kind of a pain in the butt. Oh, all right. So there's our first cross world light, and that's the, the quake medallion for the other game. <laughs> Ouch. Which is fine. I mean, not exactly what I would have uh, liked to have seen. But hey, whatever. It's uh, one less thing we really got to worry about. And once we do start up the other game, we'll uh, we'll catch up on the items we've received from this one. It'll fill in the tracker on the right-hand side there. Oh, sir. Excuse me. Five spot. Okay. We argue about some more health at the start. Try to do Dark Cross right away. <laughs> I don't know how far we're gonna get with uh, three hearts. You know, it's kind of a, a worthless front of escape here. But we'll try to go for Dark Cross. Oh, yeah. oh, come here. Oh my god, this is so annoying trying to get popped by this guy. It's 
only the, the front fireball that has the hitbox. There we go. So we'll try, we'll try Dark Cross once. With enemy rando, it becomes a bit of a, a small issue sometimes. But maybe we'll get lucky and it'll be just kind of harmless shit in our way. But if we don't get it right away, if we don't get it the first time, we're just gonna blast on out of here and do the rest of our checks. Nope. Okay. Oh, and we got a Beemos as well. Well, all right. <laughs> So I heard a bouncing spike thingy and a Beemos. Uh, that's okay, we don't need to mess with that a second time. We really do not. It's hard for the other side. Yeah. Not terribly exciting. We did turn off progression balancing on both of these as well, so we could get some Real gnarly chains of items in here. Five, uh, five rupee in the enemy drop pool, that's good. Good monies, at the very least. Oh, well, okay. Couldn't quite uh, <laughs> sneak our butts past him. And since that is a, a really late Dark World enemy, apparently did four hearts of damage. Okay. Well, just have to be a little bit more careful around him. I figured we would have been thin enough to slip past him like that, but eh, well. Ah, uh, well. No time lost just doing this again. We'll lure him over a little bit more. There we go. Good job. I just an enemy drop group as well. I think this is just small heart, so five arrows, huh? Okay. Ammunition, at the very least. And we got, ooh, nice. Single bombs on the Hoarder Crab. It's kind of impressive. Just hoping we don't really give a shit about this item here. Do we? Oh, it's a big key. <laughs> well, shit. That's not good. That is, as they say, a big key. I don't like that. That could be important or it could be worthless. A heart on the little thief dude. This is actually a bottle with a B in it, right? Yeah, okay. That's right, because I turned off B-Miser for, uh, for this, for just myself, because it's not nearly as, as fun when it's just ambushing yourself with bees. That's actually a bottle with a B in it for the other side. That's good. That's good, that's good. Also gives me some manner of offense for a single screen. <laughs> I think it was a good B as well. Oh, jeez, excuse me. So just in case we need to use it. We'll have it available to us. We got lucky on this side getting a sword immediately, so we've already got some damage output, even if it's not the greatest. Swap, worthless, 300 bucks on this side, okay. There's the Hyrule Castle small key that I thought I'd gotten earlier. And half magic, holy balls, alright. Very good. It's hard for the other side, Very good. Hey, Sweet Labondar, how you doing? Good to see you. Still have quite a few places to check before we swap over to the other game. Rest of Kakariko, South Shore, Ice Rod Cave, we might even fake flip around up to, to Zora just for completeness sake. Mm -hmm. 
50 bucks for the other side. Okay, well, that's bomb money at the very least. Skullwood small key, one of the least useful ones. Oh, a bow. That's interesting. A bow for this side. So now we've got pretty excellent offense. Blue rupee, oh boy, yeah. Pay pay hundred bucks, get five in return. Yeah, no. Yeah, nah. <laughs> I don't think so. Yeah, nah. Yeah, nah. It's gonna be confusing. Well, it might be confusing. We'll see. We're you know, first ten minutes or so. Don't really have many. Oh, okay, another piece of heart to the other side. Don't really have uh, a lot of. Uh, pointers in either direction on either side, so you know, we'll do the opening strains of everything and see what happens. Oh, confusing for you. <laughs> yeah, I suppose. I mean, I got both trackers up there so we can uh, so we can all keep track of which items I got on either side, on either game. But yeah, I, I will say it's, it's a little harder to follow for the, for the people not actually playing this, but I don't know, I think it's fun anyway. Uh, okay, let's see. A library? Worthless trash. Don't need that. I'm just gonna blind go for race game since we're doing... Multi-world is pretty high chance this is gonna be something. Perhaps a key. Means an offense, a hook shot. Any number of things. Get out of here, chicken. Jackass. Jeez, a lot of chickens under bushes. Ah, it's 20 bucks. All right, so eh, not terribly important, but not through the other side. Okay. <laughs> Very good. All right, so we've got South Shore yet. And then maybe hit up Eastern. Although we don't really have any keys or anything for Eastern, so going over there might be a little bit premature. Oh, it is four items that we can get to. One of which is technically blocked by the lamp. It's in after a couple dark rooms, but we would probably still try for it anyways. Two rock small key, huh? The other side, we can see that number tick up. So by the time we do switch over to the second game, it's going to be like another a minute or so to, <laughs> to chunk through all the items we're going to receive. Which I think at this point is like maybe four or five. Ooh, single arrow. That's important. It isn't. Oh, it's the other side, single arrow. Very good. <laughs> I guess it is. I guess it is kind of important. It gives me one shot with the bow that I don't have over there yet. Working on your pet project. Long weekend is nice. Hell yeah, long weekend is nice. Long weekend is exceedingly good. I love it. Because I get to do... <laughs> dumb bullshit. <laughs> I get to do dumb bullshit like this. Well, I mean, I could do dumb bullshit like this anytime, really, but... But long weekends are good, regardless. Regardless of what you do with them, they're good. Uh, compass to desert, you know, whatever. Only bucks. These are the other side. Red meringue to the other side. These are here for a good refill and another heart. Okay, it looks like maybe Ice Rod Cave. Possibly Hobo, and we can go, go check, um, check Zora. See what he's got, at the very least. On the ledge, and what he would be selling for 500 buckos if we had the cash for it, right?
You have a tendency to try to optimize too early and lose a lot of time. Hmm. I think I know how that goes. I do that a lot too on some of my own stuff. It's just fun doing architectural design and stuff like that sometimes. Like, hey, maybe it doesn't need to be optimized super early, but it's fun to do it. <laughs> Alright. Let's fake flip over to Hobo and then to, um... Up to Zora's domain, I guess. We don't have the Moon Pearl or the flippers, so this is going to be kind of a a waste. Well, not a waste, just a suboptimal routing. But hey, whatever. Ooh, oh, careful! I don't need to do optimal routing here. All right, so Island is pretty much nothing. I'm gonna go out of my way for that heart. Uh, oh boy, that's a dangerous <laughs> enemy to have on the water. Fucking chain jump. Get out of here. Get our way back. Ooh. It's a base palace. Yeah, uh, not one of the more valuable of the small keys. Oh, oh well. <laughs> Okay, I guess we won't fake flipper up to Zora. That's fine. That's probably fine. It is auto tracking, yes. Makes it so much easier to not have to worry about clicking on shit after I pick something up. I love it. I love that it actually works. Which means I can do stupid dumb bullshit like two games at once <laughs> and not get my self all confuzzled. Oh, oh boy. Okay. Alright, Agina, check Desert Ledge, and then maybe swap over to the other, other game and play as Mario for a while. Oh, we have one bomb left. Well, this is very convenient. Alright, what do we got over here? 50 bucks. Not worth nothing. I do end up not picking up an item. I do have to click it off myself on the tracker, but hey. That's pretty few and far between. Especially as far as multi-worlds are concerned. Oh, I'm gonna want a, at least one more bomb to go hit Sahash to Burst to Burr, but... Yeah, I'll have to pick up a new set at some point. Ah, uh, 20 bucks. Alright. Well, not terribly uh, helpful on that front, but we'll just pop in here and swap over to the other game. Boop. And wait for 20, 30 seconds as it gives me all the items. <laughs> so there's Quake. It's candy. Be in a bottle. That's 10 arrows there. Compass to whatever, which doesn't matter to swamp. Piece of heart, 50 bucks, a small key to Skull Woods, another piece of heart. Another piece of heart. There we go, 20 bucks. Should be near the end of the chain here, I think. Here. Small key to T-Rock. A single arrow, of course, very important. Another piece of heart. Red meringue, of course, can't forget that. Another piece of heart. Goodness. Okay, there we go. Now we're set. Hey, Omega Weapon, how you doing? Good to see ya. Okay, so let's see what Mario's got on his side here. I don't know that he's going to get lucky enough to get a sword right away to do front of escape, but hey. Weirder things have happened. Ooh, other side's flippers. Okay, well that, uh... Put Zora entirely in logic there, then. Okay, so maybe it's a good idea I didn't flick big flipper up to Zora before then. Considering. Sells a few more buckos as well, so we'll see if uh, that money's actually going to be going out the door real quick. 
Ooh, well, what do we got there? A big key to desert? That's interesting. Doesn't terribly help that side just yet, because we can't get into desert. No literacy. No dark world access with uh, with a mirror and mitts and a flute. <laughs> yeah, not much. Not much we can do about that just yet. But it's nice to have. Okay, I won't. Oh, that would be. I won't say no to having a big key, especially in key sanity. Like, who knows when you're gonna. Have shit. Okay, just a bomb capacity upgrade on this side for Lumberjack Ledge. That's fine. Don't need to care about that one. The big key on the other side is a little bit silly, but what do we got here? Small magics on the Hoarder Crab. Less useful than the bombs on the other side, but whatever. Eh? Spot here. What do we got? Oh, it's a small key for pod. Interesting. Small key. Swamp on this side. Alright, well, one of the more useful ones. One of the one of the small keys that blocks a lot of progress in a specific dungeon. So I'd rather have those than say. Skull Woods or Ice Palace small key. Those are fucking not necessarily worthless per se, but not terribly helpful either. Ooh, hey, excellent. Get a free bunch of gear by giving this to the bottle vendor. Very convenient. Saves me from having to buy a stack of bombs. There you go, buddy. All right. I should just talk to him right away and been like, "Hey, what are you? What are you gonna give me? If I give you a hundred bucks, what are you gonna give me in return?" And he'd be like, "Ah, oh, something worthless." I'm like, "Okay, well, you don't get a hundred bucks then." Nope. Arrow capacity upgrade for the other side. Twenty bucks for the other side. The cape for the other side. And another heart for the other side. <laughs> Oh boy, that's funny. Ooh, big key over here, the eastern big key, okay. That is immediately useful. It's me access to a fifth item over there. And if we do decide, well, I, we probably shouldn't go to eastern yet anyways, we don't have any sort of permanent offense. <laughs> we don't have the, uh, the immediate sword like we did for the other side, so. A little bit up a creek. Still. 20 bucks. For the other side. Which is fine. I think we might, we're probably pretty close to Zora money on the other side by now. Ooh, another big key here. Big key to swamp. Oh, that's gross. One of the least least useful big keys, honestly. Small key to ice. Small key to TR. Okay, that's two small keys for tier Turtle Rock on this side. Can't really get up there, so it's kind of eh in value for now, but whatever. Uh, actually, 50 rupees for the other side if I pay 100 bucks here. No thanks. That's gonna be a pass from me, dog. Roll uh, well, just a. Oopsie. Oh, normal ass chicken hunt here. Sometimes this one can be a bit problematic with enemy rando on. Like spike rollers or something. Ooh, a flute. Oh. The fastest of travel. And very conveniently placed, too, considering. Let's go up here and do. Doot. Have a drink. So that'll get us around the world in a big damn hurry. Which is nice. We'll 
wait to pop it just yet since we got a few checks locally to do. And this kid will have hey a sword, <laughs> right? Very good. Well, that makes uh, Eastern a touch more valuable now, huh? What am I drinking? I've got uh, some bullet. Or maybe it's pronounced bullet, I don't know. American rye whiskey, quite delicious. A little bit more potent than the standard 80 proof spirits folks are probably used to. I think it's a 95, 93 or 95 proof. It's quite delicious. Tis quite a delicious. Uh... Ooh, there's a moon pearl on this library. Oh, gross. Well, could be Mario's, could be Luigi's. Who knows? Uh, oops, I went, meant to go buy some bombs before going down here, so let's do that. Top up on bombs. Actually, nah, we're gonna do it. We're in here. I didn't expect to get the uh, sword. Bombs are extremely important if we were gonna try for... Mini Wormulon cave down on the south shore there. If we didn't get the sword, that would have been problematic without a full stack of bombs, but... Now that we have permanent weaponry on both sides, that's really nice. Pretty early in, too. Like 25 minutes in, we got some, some attack power. Sure, sure, sure. I'm not going to complain about that. got there. Ooh, a mirror, huh? Alright. That's a touch more valuable than uh, 20 bucks on the other side. And this this side's mirror. Ah. Excellent. Alright. Let's start at Adina this time. Got Oz and Ledge there. Not particularly valuable. I won't say no to some early health. I think we're already up to six hearts for Luigi, so... Whatever. Get a glass of blended bourbon. Ooh, bourbon. Bourbon is very tasty. Good choice, good choice. Ooh, our first burrito to Eastern, in fact. That's good, we can check what it is once we get out of here. Since we're still very much in the dark about how many crystals we need for either spot, any info is good info at this point. A glove! Is it my glove? Is it Mario's glove? It is Mario's glove. Okay. <laughs> Steel reserve. Oh, gross. Uh. Steel Reserve is disgusting. <laughs> like, I'm not a beer guy regardless, right? But Steel Reserve in particular is one of the one of the worst ones. That and Keystone Light or or Schlitz or Coors. Just piss water all the way down for all of those. Like, I'm usually not one to shame somebody for for their drink of choice but if you drink any of those you're wrong <laughs> do not do that and small key to pie though bomb up and some more bombs okay uh we got a all right right blue mail for the opposite side so now luigi's got a change of clothes coors light is a beer pong beer yeah i mean you're not, you're not wrong <laughs> i remember Buying many a case of the Keystone because it was extremely cheap and uh, quote unquote good enough for beer pong, so you know, whatever. 
Ooh, natty. Ooh, ah, ooh, ah. <laughs> Gross. We're just gonna go down the oops. We're just gonna go down the list of all of the shitty beers in existence. We could be here a while if we do that, though. <laughs> Man, it's so disgusting. Ugh. That's right. I'm glad all of us are uh, kind of of the same mind on all of those particular variants of the beer because. Ugh. <laughs> okay, let's see. Um, we can go up the mountain. We can go to eastern. Uh, I think I'll just fake flip it a hobo whilst I'm here. You know, I waste time, you know. Ugh, bonk. <laughs> Drink from the back of the toilet. Uh, you know, maybe drinking from the back of the toilet isn't as bad as drinking from the front sometimes, right? So, you, know, you, you pick the section of the toilet where it's probably less bad. Oh, oh too far. I don't know. Depends on the state of your toilet, I suppose. Although I would certainly never recommend drinking from either section of it, if you can avoid it, right? Ooh, we've got a hook shot on the island there. That's intriguing. Oh, oh boy. Okay, yep, all right. Get bopped there. Still fake flipper. Could murder us pretty good just by getting hit. There we go, okay. It's the hobo got you off. A burrito. For the other side, for the desert balance. Oh, right, we're gonna check this. Ah, it's a pendant. Because, of course, it is. And not even the useful green one. Worthless red ones. Alright, uh, you know, we're just gonna go like this. Once we're doing that, it's gonna be pod, burrito to desert, I think, right? Yeah, okay. <clears throat> uh, alright, let's go. Probably mountain. Mountain. And or um, burst to harsh to burst to burger. Uh, mountain first, I think. Unlock that. Um, that additional spawn location, right? Ow. Ooh. Okay, that's right. This can still be problematic with the uh, minimizer on. So maybe, maybe not the best idea to do it like this. But hey, ow. Sure. Yes, Vulture or whatever. Okay. I just need to make our way back. Oop, easy. Alright, we're out. So now I just need to get him. Get him to his home now. Without getting bopped too many times by. Rocks and shit, excuse me, thank you. Mm, for bombs. Terribly helpful there. Eh. Uh. Oh, oh boy. Okay. Fucking vulture. Hey, hey, you want some of this? Little shit ass. Okay. Just wanna get up the mountain and see what we can see. We've already got the... that's right, we've already got the mirror, so we can go to Hera. Not that we can do much in there. Oh, there's an ice rod there. Gross. Good thing we can get it right away. We got inside the other cape. Okay, that's gonna be Mario's cape. <clears throat> it's possible to play this LTTP mode with another real player. Absolutely. In fact, you can do it with several real players if you so choose. Definitely done our share of, um, like, ten-person things. <laughs> Not all ten people on LTTP, though. Doing the, the multi-world with uh, Factorio and Risk of Rain 2 and Minecraft, and we had Slay the Spire the other night as well. Oh, it's super cool. It is super cool. Once you get a huge group of, of folks together, you get the item pool to be, like, 1,500 items or something. It's kind of good. 
it's kind of good and fun. And also, probably a bad idea because it takes forever, but it is fun. Nice rod. Definitely grab that, some bitch. One of the most elusive items. Oh, <laughs> the Dark World is Toad. <laughs> For Mario, that's funny. I think I remember what Luigi's is. Oh, it's Mario's Ice Rod. It's kind of thrilling. I'm just gonna pop into here real quick, grab the two items that are available to us, and then get foe. Unless this is the small key to here, and it is not, I don't think. It's the G Tower small key, that's kind of gross. Oh, for the other side, alright. Chest is a bottle. All right, we're probably not going to need to worry about that. Uh, okay, can't do anything further up here, right? No. Nope. Okay. All right. Well, now we can actually pop into front of escape with our uh, our sword. Our S word. And we could try for Dark Cross on this side too, see if it's any easier than Dark Cross on the other side. So, ill equipped though we are with four hearts in it. Not a whole lot of other things. We may well just say nuts to that and leave Dark Cross for later when we have a have a lamp or perhaps a fire rod. Ooh boy, these hallways. Exceedingly dangerous motherfucking hallways here. Spike rollers and pokies. Those are typically um, Turtle Rock enemies, <laughs> not Hyrule Castle enemies. Bomb capacity again. You know what? I'm okay with bomb capacity, honestly. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Alright. Would have been a one-hit KO right there. Lots of T-Rock enemies in Hyrule Castle on this side, apparently. Oh, ha <laughs> ha! The keys don't count as a killable enemy for those rooms, that's funny. Yeah. Luigi's probably got enough money for Zora now. Go up there next time we swap back over. So that'll be one, two, three, four items. Two in the waterfall, one on Zora Ledge, and one Zora himself. sword there, but still do it. 20 bucks. Woohoo! Oh, I could have mirrored as well, but eh, we were going to end up with three hearts regardless. <laughs> ah, or four hearts. No matter. Let's see if we can get through this, because we got to traverse... Two dark rooms to get to this chest. Three, no, three dark rooms to get to this chest. Which, given the mix of enemies so far, might be a, a bit troublesome. So far, so good. Huh. Okay. There's one down. This this hallway in particular, since there's just such a high. Oh my God. Yep. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Never mind. Not doing dark cross. <laughs> That hallway in particular has six or seven enemies, so that can be a bit gross. 
That can be a bit gross in the dark. So never mind, uh, we'll get the three on the reverse end and come back to that spot. If it were vanilla enemies, which is just rats and snakes and shit, that would've been easy to see, but... Not gonna deal with two of the, the bomber dudes and presumably something else that was extremely powerful just by running into it. Wow. Gross. T-Rock enemies there, too. Ooh, Mario's Moon Pearl. 50 bucks. 50 bucks for the other side. Okay, well, just one item away from Dark World Access over here. Need either another glove or a hammer. lot of other places to check here, although with four hearts and uh, no armor upgrades, that becomes a small issue. It's Dark World all the more dangerous. So maybe we'll hold off on that, even if we do get access, maybe we'll hold off on that for a touch and see if we can get some more stuff. Or if Luigi can get some more stuff for us, rather. Uh, Misery Mire is the green pendant over here. The key for Hera on that side. Hearts and some buckos. Of course it isn't. Although half magic with ice rod is a little bit less helpful than half magic with fire rod. But we'll see what we can do. A couple dark rooms to traverse here. <clears throat> First set isn't too bad. Second set is a bit troublesome. But it's going to depend very heavily. Jeez, Lionel's on the approach here. It's going to depend very heavily on what uh, enemy spawns are going to be. Because, oof. <laughs> I think those do three arts of damage. It's kind of, kind of gnarly. But assuming we can traverse these dark rooms, Thieves Town small key. Okay. Assuming we can traverse these dark rooms, we might have a shot at beating whatever boss this is going to be. Although. At this point, we've got very few bosses we can actually beat. Uh, we could do Armos, we could do Lanmo, Wormulon, uh, Hel we could technically do Helmosaur. Couldn't do Argus because we don't have a hookshot. We could do um, Mothula and Blind, we could do Blind. Can't do... Uh, cold stare without a fire rod or a bombos. We could do vitreous, and we can't do. Okay, so we can do like two thirds of the bosses. We can't do uh, Trinex either without a fire rod. God, that would be a shitty Trinex fight, though. Four hearts, green mail. Oops. Yeah. Four hearts, green mail, and hardly any offense would be a, an extremely bad Trinex fight. Well, speaking of Bombos, Bombos for Luigi. What can be found near a fairy? Uh, near a fairy. Uh, I think that. Oops. Excuse me, sir. I think that might mean. Um, well, and there's our flippers. I think that might mean um, Pyramid Fairy. Which is uh, kind of troublesome on its own, really. So that means we need two crystals for literacy for Mario, but who knows if that book is even going to be required. Alright, so this is going to be... Oop. Uh. Okay. Got a 
pick it. That's fine. Um, uh. Okay, got another pick it. That's fine. I just want to get the key out of here, please. There it is. Try to go down on, along the south since that picket is still. Oh, good lord! I hear him. I hear him on the left. Wow! I'm actually, gonna. Oh, there's a thief. Asshole! I just want to get out of here. <laughs> there we go. Okay. Well, made it through. Let's hope we can at least get this item out of here so we don't have to do that shit again. Okay. Please. Oh my god. Fucking Hinox. Get out of here. Okay, all for the service of a fucking small ass key to Meyer for Luigi, so that's not terribly helpful. Okay. And now we can try this other this other dark room too, but boy, this is gonna be uh a task. Considering our ugh, considering our gear, although we would probably be better served by getting. Oh wait, is this the side? This is the side with the good bee. Okay, you know what? This might actually be doable then. <laughs> All right, we're gonna see if we could do this. It would be kind of wild if we managed to pull this off. All right. Oh, there's a bee mouse. That's not good. Okay, there's the key. Oh, there's two Beemos in here. Ah. Uh. Okay, we made it through the room, but <laughs> it's, it's going to be a, still a little touch and go getting through this. Try to get a part or two out of these. Okay. Rocks. Gross. Uh, I don't have a. Damn. <laughs> it's like, I don't have a net. That would have been perfect. Ow. Bitch. Too bad. Too bad of an enemy set up there, but now it's gonna be a question mark as to whether we can beat this boss. What's it gonna be? It's a Mothula. Uh well, it's gonna be a heck of a dumb fight. With just a, a plastic sword here, but Ugh. I have a feeling that if he touches me once, we're probably dead. Good fight. Okay, got a Mothula, and he is hiding bombs, and it's gonna be the red pendant, right? So not terribly helpful. But hey, one boss down. Kind of lucky it was one that we could beat. It's not terribly helpful at this current juncture. Okay, we've got flippers, so we may as well just go for Zora. Zora, Zora Ledge, hopefully he's not gonna have something important, because we do not have nearly enough money for it. Whatever it might happen to be. <laughs> Compass. Bombs. Woo! I think after this, that'll be uh, the extent of the items we can reach over here. So I'm not going back for Dark Cross. That's kind of stupid and dumb, considering the enemy sets in there. We got on the ledge. Piece of heart. We may as well just grab it while we're here, I guess. Hopefully he's not selling anything for anything here. Alright, 
Are we gonna care about this? We are not. It's a compass. <laughs> All right, good. Good, good. Well, then I think that wraps it up for this side for now. Uh, I mean, we do have the Hyrule Castle small key, so we could try to backdoor Dark Cross, but we still have to deal with a lot of enemies. But I think we'll say naw. We'll say naw to that and swap back to Luigi for a while. Um, Luigi can go up and do Zora. He can also go over to Eastern. And can't do backside of escape yet. No gloves. All right, let's do Zora first. So that'll be a yeah. Okay, five hundred seventy-six bucks. So if Zora's got something to buy. You can afford it. Got six hearts to our name. Actually, we might be able to retry Dark Cross with Luigi. Six to seven hearts with uh, blue mail. Pretty eye. Oh, we've got powder too. It's nice. Uh, uh. <laughs> Powder's nice. It's a good backup weapon. Or not weapon necessarily. Good good backup safety item. Need fairies. Uh, keep Gans Tower. Get on this side. Uh, what's the. It's bombs, right? Yeah, alright. Let's uh, stock a little bit here. Thank you. We got the Hyrule Castle small key on this side, too. Oh, there's a hammer on the ledge. Oh, boy. Whose hammer is that going to be? If that's Mario's hammer, that's, uh, it's Dark World Access. <laughs> Which is, uh, not exactly what I wanted to see 51 minutes in, but hey. I guess it'll be fine. Mushroom. Oh, gross. But alright. It's a fetch quest, but it is an actual item. <laughs> That's a fetch quest we can do pretty quickly, though, with the flute, so whatever. Which hammer is this? Oh, it's Mario's hammer. <laughs> well, okay. Um. That's kind of troublesome. You know, a lot more to do for Mario's side of things. Let's so we'll do a few things over here if we can, though. Uh, three in the old man's closet here, and then maybe pop into Eastern. There's four we can get to. No big key, so we can't actually beat the dungeon just yet, but... Mm -hmm. There's the skull woods on this side. Not the worst place to have it, I guess. Literacy for Luigi. Uh, well, that puts uh, Desert Palace kind of in play here. So we can get in there, but we can't get to the back because we don't have a glove for Luigi. No gloves for Luigi. Luigi is playing with gloves on. But. Might just head on over there once we're done dipping into Eastern here. Oh, that means that uh, Luigi's Moon Pearl is on Mario's library. Oh. So Luigi's gonna be boots locked out of Dark World. Or Mario's boots locked out of Dark World. 
But you know, I'm probably fine. Probably fine. already full on bombs regardless. He wasn't before, now he is. Eastern, gross. Oh, that's a big kitty, so do we? So just, okay, so I guess just one more. Well, no, two more items we can get to. Get one on our way through and then one past a couple dark rooms yet again. Which, honestly, we might go for the second set of dark rooms too, to see if we can get the small key out of it. aren't terribly important anymore. We do have a couple <clears throat> a couple shops and or item games to do yet. Just need a, a little oh wait, we don't have the big key. Alright, seven hearts blue mail makes this a little bit less troublesome, but it's still gonna depend on what enemies are in here. Looks like I heard a keys. Keys and we had a oh something else in here too, huh? I don't know what it was. Whatever it was, it did half a heart of damage, so not terribly troublesome. Where are we? There we are. There it is. <laughs> it's like for the dumbass thing with the key under it. Okay, it's a very tame dark room. I like that. Oh, sorry. We don't have the big key, do we? Alright. I think then we'll just clear out this room and we'll just hang out here as Luigi for a while. Hey, you little bitch. Then if we do get a lamp or a, an eastern big key on Mario's side, then Luigi will just be right here. It'll be very convenient. Extremely rare that it works out that way. But, you never know. Okay, so now Mario can do a whole butt ton of things. With his four hearts and no armor. Uh, I guess we can do the mushroom turn-in right away. item. Not for a compass. Woohoo. Alright, well. <laughs> for hair, no less. Do we have any more burritos? No. Okay. <clears throat> well, now we've got our choice of things to do. Oh, we can go get, um... There was something on the, uh, the island on Mario's side. We can go get that now. I feel like maybe that was a hook shot or something. So let's uh, let's do the one over in Village of Outcasts first. Despite not having the fire rod, do we have a? Okay, we got a skull with small key though. It's gonna be a lot of a lot of checks up you know, right away.
Ooh, it's Luigi's mirror. Doesn't get him anything, but it's very helpful for later. <laughs> Castle burrito for Luigi. idea to come to Skullwoods first, that mirror is gonna be important later on, I'm sure. 20 bucks. Had like maybe one or two seeds where the mirror wasn't required. Five bucks there. Uh, do we have the big key? We do not have the big key to Skull. So, one more here and then we can get foe. Giganto pain in my butt here. Yeah. Uh. Okay. I just want to make sure. He, oh, I just want to make sure he doesn't bounce his butt up, up between the door. Oh, like almost there. Thanks, buddy. So it becomes a pain in the ass to deal with. Hello. No, I don't have powder on this side. Luigi's got the powder. Okay, nothing but arrows, so... That's the extent of Skull Woods for now. Let's see if we do it. We do have the cape already. Okay, so we could technically get what's on the uh, bumper ledge here. And we can do graveyard ledge too. Nice having early mirror. What do we got? Ooh, blue mail. Yes, please. I mean, it could be Luigi's red mail, but it could also be Mario's blue mail. So, yes, please give me that. We're gonna be wandering around Dark World with four hearts. I'm gonna want some armor. Good, good, good. So not quite as treacherous anymore, but still a big kind of side-eye question mark as to whether or not we want to be here with four hearts. Terribly valuable, but probably still necessary that we did it. Oh, oh, all right. You know what? We'll take the zap through there instead of taking the bot from the glowy skull. Probably better that way. Would have been one heart instead of at least two. Okay. Oh, we've got the Thieves Town small key, but we don't have the big key, so we'll just be the front four. 
front four this time around, unless we find the big key in here somewhere. Burrito to pod. Oh, do we have any, um, side, or burrito to swamp, rather. Do we have any, uh, other ones? No. You know, swamp is a five sixer. That's good, considering there was a hint for, what, Luigi's literacy, right? Or no, Mario's literacy is on Pyramid Fairy on Luigi's side, actually. <laughs> Crap. I think that's what the hint was, anyways. TR, small key. Oh, I suppose technically we can do East Side Death Mountain now. So we have the hammer and all that shit to get up there. Might be helpful to do. So we finish our Dark World sweep the first time through here. Oh, wait, second sword? Sure. Slightly better damage output. Let's say no. Ah, it's the single arrow for Luigi. So both runs are valid. <laughs> They're single arrows. Sure. Well, we're gonna be traversing dangerous areas. Having full health won't be too bad. Third sword, holy crap. Okay, yeah. Alright. Pretty good for offensive capability now, thank you. Kind of incredible. Alright, good idea to go into Thief's Town. <laughs> We're fighting with bacon. I mean, a little bit low on the old health situation still, but... Damage output, status, pretty good. Say no to more bombs. Alright, stumpy, what you got? Ah, oh, it's compass. Woohoo. We can do... Well, we can actually do the entirety of, uh, of Swamp here, can't we? That's kind of disgusting. Although, maybe not terribly disgusting, considering our newfound damage output. Should 
should be able to do most of it. We got him. Oh, we don't have a hookshot. That's that's the trouble here. Ah, oh, the big key to pod. Okay. And Brian and shovel for Luigi. Hearts and shit. Uh, we'll skip swamp for now. <laughs> I really don't want to go in there if I don't have to. Uh, we can go get pyramid and um, <clears throat> check how many crystals we need for Ganon. That will be good info to have. We can do catfish and then we can zoom our way back down to, uh, let's see, swamp and ice. Gross. Okay. No, we can't do ice just yet because we have no means of casting the fire. As, as of yet, unassailable. something down on that Lake Hylia Island. I did not tick that one off, so maybe something of value. Or maybe it was something not extremely valuable and I just forgot to mark it off. Oops. So we'll find out soon. Find out in a minute or two. Terribly helpful. <laughs> Usually just one of those is good enough. But I guess it will depend on if we need to go up to the tower to get something, because in this particular setup there could be something in Ganon's Tower that's required. For either side, either Mario or Luigi, or both. Bother dipping into pod. Oh, except I do want to check pyramid first. Get us some information. We've got a key to be either zero through four, or to be one of zero through four here. Kind of cut off the the high end of the range just to speed this along a little bit. Let's see what we're dealing with. One. Excellent. Okay. Count for being Ganon is not going to be the <clears throat> the high roller this time. Honestly, if we could beat, well, we need to be able to get up to, to the tower as well. Never mind. <laughs> it's like, well, if we could beat a dungeon, we would have uh, technically have everything we need to beat Ganon right now. If we did Silverless. Which we've done, you know, plenty of. Alright, uh, I think yeah, we need to go this way anyways. Eat whatever's on the island. And we'll head our butts up to, uh, up the mountain again, I guess. Huh? This was a hookshot. Whose was it, though? It's Mario's hookshot. All right. Good call to come over here, then. Ha! Huh. All right. That's better. Well, that puts uh, Swamp entirely on the table now. But we will get to that in due time. This way. 
This is always fun doing it this way. Having to deal with any dumbass stairs to just do this. <laughs> There, bomb capacity, lots of bombs for Luigi. He's gonna be set to go. Bucks for Luigi. Key! That's a tower small key. Gross. It's gonna be his first one. Fire Rod for Mario, all right. I think at this point we are more or less safe against any boss except for Cold Stare. Oh no, no, we're good with Cold Stare because we got the Fire Rod. All right. I think whatever bosses we encounter now for Mario are going to be Beatable. Since we got the hammer for Elmasaur, we got both rods for Trinex, the hook shot for Argus. Ain't nothing gonna hold us back. All right, twenty bucks on the island, and we don't have a book, and we don't have um, what else do we have? We don't have any of the Harris stuff. So we can just do. Uh, Spiral here. I guess we could do Spike Cave as well. Ew, that's kind of gross with uh, five hearts. I guess I do have a fairy as well. Got five hearts. We've got Cape. We technically, do Spike Cave. Kind of gross. We may be better off just going down to Swamp now, actually. Bit of books. items, 10 checks to do here. So whatever boss we get to at the end should be perfectly murderable. Are now pretty okay equipment. We don't have to worry about flooding the key on because we already got the key. <laughs> so the next one, we just got to remind ourselves not to be too hasty in letting the flood waters out.
got small key to Meyer for Luigi. Woohoo! Not much that Luigi can do now. I guess he does have the shovel, so he can do that fetch quest over there. Alright, do not flood the keys. Walk right by. Good job, good job. There's really not much else he can do right now. I suppose he can get into desert, which is... One, two, two items we can do. Oh, right, now we gotta do the whole floody flood flood thing. Luigi's stacked. He's probably got a full first roll already. Mario's just kind of... <laughs> Jeez. Mario's just kind of languishing behind with five hearts. And he's powering through regardless, so whatever. A tough old Italian plumber. Right, Luigi's the one with the powder. Our small key. Gross. So Luigi's Dark World Access might be Ega Tower. <laughs> Assuming we find a lamp shortly here, too. ugly in this state of affairs, but, you know, honestly, we've got the... got everything we need to take care of it, I guess, so. <laughs> Gross, having it on Swamp. I 
Oh, for the glove. Okay. <laughs> okay, well, that opens up a whole heck of a lot of other things for Mario now, too. Plus, we can go up to uh, Ganon's Tower. <laughs> Which, at this point, might not be a bad idea. Considering. Uh, we might jet around to a few different places first. If we find the GT Big Key, like, we can almost... Because if G Tower is one or zero crystals, right? Then we are just about set to go here. Kind of wild. Fire requires bombos. GT small key. Well, considering the extreme number of GT small keys we've got, it might be pushing us to go up there regardless, huh? Three out of the, I think, four that are floating loose here. Take a quick stop in the desert as well and get the two, well, four items, I suppose. Red mail. It's not gonna be Luigi's or Mario's. Mario's. All right. <laughs> okay. Five Hearts Red Mail is uh, an interesting state of affairs. But okay, you know, can't really complain too loudly about it. Suppose better that than the reverse of like 10 Hearts and Green Mail. Alright, I'm just gonna swipe that key real quick. Head on into desert. We don't have the big key. We won't be able to get what's on the torch. But we can at least check what's on the torch and get one, two, three loose items here. Hmm, small key is on the torch here. That's kind of gross. Half magic can be found in a cave of mimicry. Okay, so Mimic Cave will have Mario's half magic. Uh, can I uh, torch, right? One second. Uh, dungeon will have, what's that, like a small key, right? Yeah. Okay. Just record that, just in case I'll need to come back for that, because we have no idea what sort of small key that's going to be. do the rest of the Dark World sweep. Well, most of it anyways. Get a fair few things. One, two, three, four. And then now we can go up and do uh, Dark Death Mountain as well. So... On the very slim chance that we'll get G Tower Big Key before we head up there. Definitely be a thing. It's a thing that can happen, even if it's not exceedingly likely. Oh, I guess we can do the rest of Skull Woods while we're up here, too, actually. Not guaranteed to be able to get into G Tower just yet, anyway, so this is gonna be another. Now we won't know, but. 
Good chance that this will be a, a normal ass crystal we can do. Increase our chance of being able to get into G Tower straight up when we get up there. May as well just do it right now. Plus, it's another three items, so, you know, whatever. Okay, so. Although, this being the worst boss spot in the world because of the conveyor belt and spikes, we'll see what we can manage here. I think we do still have a fairy in a bottle, so we should be alright there. Ducks for Luigi, hooray. health as we can here. Because this still could be cold stare in here, at which point we're gonna need full ass magic to deal with them. health to probably deal with the rest of them. So, okay, full magic, that's good. What is it? Oh, it's a blind. Okay, you know what? That's fine. kind of wish I had full health to use sword beams. That's alright. Make this work, maybe? God damn it. Such a pain in the ass to hit from the top there. using our fairy if we can. Nice. Okay. Excellent. Got as good as it needed to be work out. Oh, and it's a heart container too. And a crystal. Great. Okay. Good. We don't have the big key. Alright, so that one's going to hang out for a while. Crystal's pretty good. Okay. Alright, now we can move on to the rest of the Dark World stuff. going to be Blacksmith's Purple Chest, Peg Cave. That's about it. And then we can go off the mountain again, do Dark Side, uh, East Death Mountain. That's right, because uh, Luigi is still Mario boots locked out of, um, out of Dark World. And a few other items locked out of Dark World, actually, too. Kind of bad. Nice. 
Hmm, not terribly helpful there. Oh, right, I have to grab the uh, blacksmith. Or frog, rather. is our other red crystal. That's interesting. I can actually go do that. What's that? That's the Hera big key. Alright. I suppose technically we could go up and do that too. My goodness, we got so many things we can do on the way to G Tower here. Um, yeah, let's just go ahead and do this. out of Dark World anyways to go over to Ice Palace. Even though we're missing... We do have a small key, that's good. We're missing the big key, which is whatever. Oops. Oh, Luigi's first bottle, okay. Uh, Alright, let's do Ice Palace first, I suppose. Um, if we go to Pod now, though, could we technically go through to the boss? I guess we got the one small key we need. Could technically go do that! Uh, oh, except no lamp, so that set of dark rooms is gonna be problematic. So maybe we'll skip that for now. No, I have done dark rooms for the back of Pod there. I would rather not have to. Small key ice mask can be found in a well. Okay, well, we did that already. T-Rock. Well, that's all well and good. I guess we can backdoor T-Rock if we need to. Uh, except we don't have the big key, so we might skip that as well. Maybe not. Hmm. Shit. Hmm. It's two pixels. There. There we go. Okay. Got it eventually. Lineup for that seemed a little fudgy. It's a difference on the Mario sprite shadow, I think. That's all right. We made it past. As long as we do this in one go, we're not gonna have to worry about nothing else. Ooh, that's a gross set of enemies. <laughs> Oh, 
All but one of the items here, so four more to go. Oh, Luigi's flute. Okay. That's good. Um, that gets him up the mountain. And into Hera, so now Luigi's got some things he can do. Good. Stop being a lazy ass freeloader. <laughs> There. Energy tower small feet for Luigi. out of here, go fight the boss, maybe get a third crystal. Oh, right, it's the other five sixer. Oops. This is actually really nice. Because then I think we can go get um, go get Mario's literacy, because I believe that one's in Pyramid Fairy Cave here. Or Pyramid Fairy, rather. Pod anyways, we don't have the bow. Alright, so maybe we skip that and just go up the mountain now. Here we're all said and done. Looks like Landmo. Easy fight. <laughs> or a small key. To G Tower. Alright, well that's all four of the loose ones, so it definitely wants me to head up there. That's crystal number three. Excellent. I suppose if Hera is another crystal and we're looking at a four crystal G tower, we're pretty much guaranteed a, a good thing here. So we'll do Pyramid Fairy first, though, if that's going to give me literacy for Mario. tab and we're up there doing our tower business. I really wish we had the G Tower big key because then we would be pretty much set to go to complete the Mario game. <laughs> this is kind of wild. <laughs> Please don't read this message until my birthday. Well, somehow I don't think I'm going to keep this chat window open in its present state for another two and change months. <laughs> but I appreciate the sentiment all the same. How you doing, Archmuffin? Good to see you.
So if I remember the hint correctly, I believe Mario's literacy is here. If not, then it's in Luigi's Pyramid Fairy, which is uh, not going to happen for a while. Let's see if I remember. Nope, there's Mario's literacy. Excellent. And then another bottle for Luigi. Perfect. Perfect. Uh, okay, now we can go... Uh, can't do the rest of the desert yet. We can check pedestal if we really heard it. Doing alright, working at the moment on the value a bit, how are you? I'm doing good. Doing really good. Thank you. It's a nice Friday night. Holiday-ish weekend, so I was off of work yesterday and today. So it's nice to kick back a little bit, you know? Uh, let's head up the mountain. Head up the mountain, we can do Tower of Hera, I suppose, right? Let's do that right away, get it out of the way, yeah. Hit Ether tab, and then bust a move on over to G Tower. Which, you know, we're almost guaranteed to be able to get into at this point. Since we've capped out the Crystal Rando at maximum of four. We are at three presently. Well, we do know that we need to find Mario's boots. So that is locking Luigi out of the Dark World. It's that uh, Misery Meyer small key. Woohoo! Worthless. Alright, uh, okay, so we've done the first couple checks in Hera already. Dip in real quick and finish it off, except for the basement one, since we don't need the small key. Whatever. Probably nothing. Hopefully it's nothing. Eh. Finish off here, we're gonna go do uh, Dark East Death Mountain. And we'll trail back to. Your bucks for Luigi. Westmost chest and swamp palace contain a heart. And a heart. <laughs> Great. I think. Uh, we already did that, didn't we? Yep, swamp palace. Well, uh, Alright, let's do bomb jump here. So we're not gonna have the boots to bonk back, you know? Let's do that. Boy. Luigi's Bloomerang. Happy birthday, Luigi. Let's see what we're fighting at the top of this particular tower. A Vitreus. Not terribly threatening. Considering we've got uh, the Red Sword. Not as convenient as if we had silver arrows. Oh, well, let's not get knocked down. That would be unfortunate. This is me. Uh, okay, yeah, that should be fine. Easy peasy. Alright, hopefully this is another crystal. It's the other pendant, I'm gonna be a little upset. Okay, great. We are guaranteed to be able to get in the tower. Which I am excited to buy. Uh, too bad we don't have the boots. And too bad we don't have the G Tower big key yet. But, Apparently one of those seeds where we're going to have to head into the tower anyways. There are a lot of items there. 22 or 21, I believe, we can reach without the big key. So that's a little something-something, isn't it? Now... Uh, okay. Let's jump down here. 
One of these dates, I will uh, psych myself up enough to do an entrance rando. But boy, howdy, is that going to take a bit? Take a bit to be willing to do. <laughs> they'll need some way to track entrances. Even if it's just like writing it down on paper or using notepad or something. Wood so, small key. He's just, just hanging out in Eastern Palace forever until he gets out of there. Oh, that's right, Luigi's got his flute now, so that's pretty good. Uh, let's just, just for the sake of info, what do we need to get into T-Rock? Uh, Bombos, well, we've got that one. Oh, no, we don't. It's, oh, wow. It's Bombos for both Meyer and T-Rock for Mario. That kind of stinks, but it does keep me out of there for a while. Well, if we find the big key, we can just backdoor it anyways, so whatever. Yeah, that's it. Small key to Hera. Okay, well, we can clean out the rest of Hera. The last item that's in there. And another heart! Hey, that's... probably useful. <laughs> At this point, extremely useful since we're going to G Tower. Not even gonna need to. Oop, excuse me. Uh oh. You. Okay. I'm gonna need to check the sign to see how many crystals we need, because we're guaranteed to get in. Now. How many was it? Three. Okay. Yeah, not unreasonable. Considering we capped it up to four. I don't think you'd ever be able to do a full entrance shuffle. The dungeon entrance shuffle dealt psychic damage. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it does take a... a special kind of masochism to do that to yourself, right? I just think it'd be kind of kind of spicy and fun to try it at least once. Mayhaps. Mayhaps at least once. Possibly twice. Um, but beyond that, perhaps. Perhaps not. Ooh, ten more arrows. <laughs> Ten arrows. Okay, right. We can't do right hand side without um, without Samaria. So there's minus four items. Oh, and there's Bombos on the torch. That fucking sucks. <laughs> I don't know if that's Luigi's or Mario's. So it doesn't really matter at this point since we can't get it. So Meyer and T-Rock may well be boots locked for Mario. If that is his his Bombos. T-Rock small key for Luigi. A bow for Mario, okay. There we go. It's back of pod access at the very least. It's not terribly helpful at this point without the silvers. Sneaky, hiding that chest under that damn beamos. Little a-holes. Eh. So what would be really handy and convenient is if we found the G Tower big key in here somewhere. <laughs> eh? Ah. <laughs> that would be real nice. So then we could just do the do the tower climb and then we'd be set to go to complete the game for, for Mario here. That's really all we're missing. 
But then Luigi's got a, a shit ton of stuff that he needs, so... It wouldn't be done, necessarily. That would, uh, take Mario out of the running, really. Kita Hera for Luigi, okay. Compass, <laughs> Tower Compass, woohoo. Rock Compass, okay, I guess we're doing the- uh, Ow! Bitch. We're doing the... Back side of this, a couple- that'll be three more items. After the, uh, first boss refight here, right? But then I believe that's it, that's all we can do here. So we don't have the big key to do the rest of the climb, and we don't have Samaria to do the right hand side, so... Wimp Womp. the stupid way, because I don't remember... I 100% remember the path here. We'll just light the torch and, and be on our way. Light the torch, run around, do the thing, right? You could try the bomb jump across that gap, but boy howdy, is it, is it annoying? Especially with that fuck. Oh good, now he's on the fucking hidden path. Great. Love it. Alright, we're gonna relight that exceedingly quickly. <laughs> Just fuck that. Oh, come on. It's not gonna be a cold stare on this refight then. We are currently down a significant amount of magic. It's not a- Oh, it is a cold stare. Fuck me, I don't have any... Ah, I don't have any magic potion to get through this. <laughs> Damn it. Of course it's a cold stare. Ugh, gross. Alright, we'll have to come back when we've got some magic, I guess. Um... Yeah, I guess we'll just... We're on out of here for the time being and probably put Mario on the bench for a second while we do some Luigi stuff. Activating his flute, doing Tower of Hera. Uh, what else can we conceivably do? Not much. We can get into desert, I suppose. But not the back half, since no glove. Eastern big key out of that, so... Alright. Luigi, do your thing, I guess. Oh, wait. Gotta activate the flute first. The... Alright, so now Luigi can get up the mountain. Get the Hera. Can't do East Death Mountain yet. There's no access without a hammer or a hook shot. Uh, can do most of the desert. We've got Dig Spot. Oh my god, that's right, Luigi's got the plastic sword too. Oh, that's right, got Sick Kid. Sick Kid as well. Alright, well. Couple tiny things we can do here. We have the Hyrule Castle small key, so technically we could go for Dark Cross and all the way back, but boy, that would be annoying. It would be annoying, I'd much rather have a lamp to do that. We have yet to see a lamp for either side of things. Which is gross, but hey, work with what you got. We get real lucky we find half magic for Mario or something. That would be very well timed, but uh okay, dig spot. God, I was right, Luigi 
does have a full row of hearts. <laughs> Oof. Exciting there. Right, let's see if we get... Oh god, we've got Lionels in here. Uh... <laughs> eh. Just let me through. We'll deal with you on the way back. Ow! Ow! Stop! <laughs> Damn it. Ooh, this is gonna be a rough go of things on the way back, too. Believe me, wanna be okay. Thank you. Okay. It's fine. Damage boost through everything. Go, 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 go. <laughs> Oof. Okay, do we have... We do have... Okay, we've got the cape. <laughs> Just in case things get real spicy. Alright, we made it. Good enough. Oh, <laughs> bonk. You know what? That's fine. That's fine. Because we can just appear right here. Perfect. use some additional offense. Well, that's going to be his hammer. So there we go. Additional offense for Luigi. I forgot to check inside. Oh, that's neat. I forgot to check inside for his uh, item inside Spectacle Rock. But hey, hammer is nice. Yoink. Let's see what we got inside. So now that opens up east side Death Mountain, at least on the light side. That's just a burrito, so it's going to be a hard pass for me. Good. Hammer is real nice. Give this better offense. A lot of utility. Can't complain at all about that. Alright, some money on the ether tablet. Don't need that shit. Done. Okay, we haven't done any of Hera with Luigi. But we can do it in its entirety because we got both keys. It's the Thieves Town small key. Okay, well, that's good, but we don't have the Thieves Town big key. It's so kind of worthless. So we may as well just do this once we're here. Take a short coffee break on the blocks and have a drink or something. There we go. Ah. Uh. <laughs> uh, oh, we don't have any fire source. Never mind, this is worthless. <laughs> Damn it. That's right, I forgot we don't have a fire rod or a lamp for Luigi. That sucks.
Ice balance. All right, let's do the bomb jump again. Oh well. <laughs> do the bomb jump again. Bonk. Oops. Well, that sucks. All right, climb it up yet again. Cycle up and down these stairs every gosh dang time. There we go. Uh oh. Um. Ugh, okay. Well, Master. <laughs> oh, all right. There's the uh, King of Samaria from Mario. All right. So now I can do the right hand side. Do that. We do right hand side. Ow. We do right hand side. Will we come out with full magic so we can do uh, cold stare? I wonder. Or should we? We should probably pop out, grab some potions first. Well, grab a potion. Ah. Uh, oh, all right. So we got a helm up here, which is actually doable now with our hammer. I mean, it would have been doable just with bombs, too, honestly, but... A little bit safer than trying to huck a bomb with this idiot's big-ass noggin. Oop. Although, doing second phase is going to be a gigantic pain in the booty, because, ugh, hardly any... Well, we do have the bow, actually. Makes that easier. <laughs> All right, so that'll be our first boss for Luigi. Twenty bucks and a crystal. All right. Good. 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 Was that a normal crystal or a red one? Oh, that was a red one, even. Excellent. Excellent, excellent. All right, then. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Goodness. All right, so now we've got one crystal for Luigi. Check what's on the floating island up here. It is, ooh, a big key. Uh, too bad we can't get to that without a moon pearl and two gloves. <laughs> Which we know where his moon pearl is. It's on, it's on the library in uh, Mario's world there, but. Oofta oofta, another big key locked behind other dumb garbage for Luigi here. Because we know there's a big key on Lumberjack Ledge, which is sort of stupid. Because who knows what big key that's going to be. Might be one of the very important G Tower big keys for either of Mario or Luigi. Who knows? Who knows? Eh. that down before I forget them too, because eh, the key. Hmm. 
<laughs> ah, there's Luigi's G Tower big key. Okay. One problem solved, many to go. Oh, wait. I wanted to go up. Go up the stairs, you ding dong. Get down here. Also doesn't matter. Jeez. Oh, hey, blue potion. Extremely timely. Too bad I didn't uh, just pause it on the cold stair fight there. Oh well. Ah. Honk. Blue potion is extremely timely though. Oh no, we did uh, spiral here, so we're probably done. Uh, okay. Well, we can do Batman and part of Desert, and we can try to make our way through Dark Cross for, uh, for the back of Escape there. That would be something. Part of desert, and that's about it. Then Luigi's kind of sitting on the bench again until he gets some other <laughs> progression items, like his hookshot, a couple of rods, boots, gloves, etc. Not been kind to Luigi this go around. tower as well. That's kind of gross. I have both keys, but without that lamp I'm going to try to hold off, because I'm not dealing with that dark maze. Or if I am, I'm going to look up a map for it, because fuck that dark maze. Luigi's powder? Sword can be found near a fairy. Oh, okay. So Luigi's got another sword at Pyramid Fairy. We go to Thieves Town. It's kind of worthless. Alright, well, I'm gonna bank on not needing to complete desert, so we're gonna go steal that key from the back. Oh wait, we can't, because we don't have, uh, a glove. Well, that was fun while it lasted. <laughs> Alright, let's try Dark Cross. Again, now that we have 12 hearts in Blue Mail. So that'll get us 1, 2, 3, 4, if we can make it all the way back. I wonder, we can probably cast Bombos, right? So if we really need to to guarantee that we're gonna get through these rooms. Let's cast Bombos and everything will be fine. That might be pretty helpful actually. Cast it three times, one in the 
One in the narrow approach here, the second dark room. And then one in dark cross itself, just to guarantee that we'll get through. Alright, because I know there was... Ow, it's Beemos, right? Stop it! Okay, can we just go around then? Alright. Bitch ass Beemos. Something else is standing in my way too. Oh yeah, yeah, no. Oh, two of those. Okay, it's fine, I guess. Wiggle our way through. Let's see if we need to. Oh, I don't know. Okay, I'm just gonna do it. <laughs> Fuck it. I don't know if that'll uh, kill the Lionel up there. I'll at least kill the jackass guard who's coming after me. Have a, do I have a fairy? I don't have a fairy. Okay, you know what? I might just use that just to make sure we get through here. Okay. There we go. It's falls. Okay. Alright. Get through there. Okay. We're up through there. Um, now, however... <laughs> I don't exactly remember which room this is. Okay, right, the two water rooms, right? It's been a while since I've done this the front way. I think it's the, it's the other water room, and then this is gonna last up here, right? And then this is the room with the enemy key drop on it, which I think is gonna be that Bari Bari up there. Certainly, right? Yep. Okay. Now I just need to get through here once again. There. Excellent. Made it through. Okay. Well, just had to use one of the potions, so that's fine. What'd that get us? 20 bucks? Ooh. Ah, the G Tower big key. Nice. And 20 more buckos. Alright, well... Uh, Mario is set to complete. <laughs> Which might be what we just do, just to get our shit done here. Um, yeah, I guess we'll just go beat the game with Mario. <laughs> oh, that's funny. That is funny as hell. Um, oh, now we've got the, right, got the King of Samaria, so we may as well just clean out G-Tower of Items, because this is now 14 more we can get. You gotta think that some of it's gonna be useful. Uh, do we have a cape? We do have a cape. Alright, this will be nice and easy then. Let's kind of hang out for a bit. <laughs> so I'll have to do the right side torches, which is going to be fine, whatever. Um, yeah, it's going to be interesting. It's going to be kind of a rough go of things. We'll have to do this uh, carefully, because I don't want to use the blue potion until we're facing down Cold Stare on the other boss refight. because he definitely needs it. Yep. Clear this one out. Um, yeah, we're just going to do this right away. Got to be on our mustard. Although I probably should have dispatched these enemies down here first. Ah, well, it's fine. bombs here, because I want to preserve as 
a little bit of my magic for later. Ah, there's Mario's boots. Holy shit, so early G Tower was fucking required, wasn't it? Because now that's uh, gonna be Luigi's moon, moon Pearl. And whatever was on the. There was something on the torch, though, on the left hand side, wasn't there? I think it was a Bombos. That might. Oh, okay, that's gonna be Mario's Bombos then. Er, that kind of stinks. Because now that gets us into T Rock. <laughs> like, all the way through. Essentially, right? Ah, well. Still don't have that T-Rock big key. Small magic. Yeah, I'm gonna use the Samaria block. Oh well. So now we'll have three, four, three after the boss refight, four in the big chest, and then one, two, three, four on the climb. That should be all eight we are presently missing. Oh no, now we've got the boots, we can bonk across. We might not even need to use our... Oopsie. Might not even need to use that blue potion now. Which would be all the better, honestly. But just in case we need to. It's there. Oh, plus we've got Bombo. So yeah, yeah, we'll definitely be safe on this then. Excellent. Now we can just go bonk bonk. Bombos on cold stair and win the game. <laughs> cold stair on ice is gonna be kind of, kind of a silly fight, but should be safe enough to do this. I think we still have a fairy. Should probably check that before we just go straight in here. Yeah, we do. Okay, good. Alright, I'll do three here, but do not mirror out. Oh my god, Mario's lamp? That's gross. <laughs> Alright, glad we came back down here for it. Oh, put fucking Mario's lamp in G Tower. That's. Mm. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Come the F on with that. Kind of a disgusting trick for RNG to play on us. But hey, it's uh, all perfectly possible with our current settings. Oh my goodness, there's Luigi's glove in G Tower as well. Oh man, come on. <laughs> uh, well, that still doesn't give him Dark World access though, uh, but we can give him Dark World access very shortly because uh, his Moon Pearl is on Mario's library. Which we should do before we beat the game on this side, I suppose, huh? Yeah, pretty easy. Pretty easy detour to do, honestly. We just need to go on over. You can mirror out near the pyramid, flute on over, and then 
go take care of business. This is funny. This is a funny fucking route we've had to do. I'll tell you what. The seed has a sense of humor, which I can appreciate. The lamp and glove in G Tower is kind of funny. Like, it's kind of garbage, but also kind of funny. So, like, I can't really be mad about it. Oh, tiny matrix, okay. Probably would have been good info to have earlier. Sounds like a wormy lawn. That's fine. It's an easy one to deal with. Ah, it's a normal two-eyed wormy lawn too. Ooh, that's less exciting. Wait this one out so we don't saw clock. That would be really unfortunate. Completeness sake. Alright, what's our final quote unquote refight gonna be here? Damn, the items on the climb have been kinda garbo. Ah, it's another. I guess this will be our first Homosaur from Mario. <laughs> kind of an obnoxious place to have this, actually. of the weird-ass platform we're dealing with. Oh, well, on account of me doing dumb bullshit like that, too. <laughs> Duh, burp.
for our validation. Very good. We've beaten the game without uh, a full first row of hearts. It's kind of rare. Not that we terribly need a lot of the health, but it's helped to have it on hand just in case. I think that was a double hit. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. All angles, geometry. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> there we go. All right. Well, each shit egg a two. Okay, so now we gotta take a quick detour over to the library. Get the, uh... Get the Moon Pearl for Luigi. Uh, I guess there's a couple other places we could go as well. Let's go ahead and... Move on down to say about you know? Over to the library, get Luigi's Moon Pearl, that'll get him. Oh, that's, that's my flight. I'll get him Dark World access. So he can do some things, and then we can just kind of torpedo back and uh, finish the game with Mario here. Just have to see how many different items we're gonna need for Luigi yet. We're gonna need his hook shot. We're gonna need a fire source of some kind. Uh, I guess we can S and Q. I think that'll preserve my portal. And even if it doesn't, I can always go around. We got Bonk Rocks, King's Tomb. Uh, Bombos tablets. Can't do the rest of. Oh, Desert Palace also had a small key on it, so I've got that too. Oh, bitch. We got that too. Um, but yeah, it looks like it's gonna be mostly Luigi from here on out now. He's got many more places he can go to. Ugh, Castle Tower small. I guess I can technically do that now, huh? Oh, and, uh,. And Dark Cross. That's kind of gross. Alright, I guess I'll clean up most of the overworld here first before we beat the game. Just in case, who knows. I need second glove for Luigi as well. Alright, so we're not missing too much, I don't think, but it could kind of be anywhere now at this point. Anywhere on Mario's side, really. up there. Oh, that's Mimic Cave, isn't it? And I think Mimic Cave was kind of Garbo, wasn't it? One of the Mimic Caves was stupid bullshit. I think it was Mario's. Uh, Alright, let's go to... Let's go to Dark Cross. Dark Cross, and we can do Aga Tower approach. Two items there. Uh, oh no, it did do away with my portal. It's because of the S and Q. Kind of stinks. <coughs> Excuse me. It's ready for that one. All right. Well, Dark Cross will be pretty easy now since we've got a lamp. All 
matter what the enemy's situation happens to be. that did me in. Yes, crabs and bomber idiots. Oh god, that's gross. <laughs> that's kind of disgusting, yeah. Glad we uh, noped out of that the first time. Oh, for a heart container, okay. Well, now we've got the... Now we've got the first row. here and then it's gonna be a bunch of one-off spots everywhere so we may well and some a pod and some a t-rock most of t-rock in fact Oops. most of t-rock since we don't have the big key it'll cut off the second half ah well there's luigi's other glove so glad we picked that up <laughs> Okay, one item closer. Okay, takes care of the rest of that. Should we even bother doing anything else before we beat the game here? So we've got one, two. Three, and whatever else we can get out of T-Rock, so probably another five there, so eight, maybe more than that, so maybe nine, and then whatever we can get access to in Pod, which is a big fucking question mark. So not too many over here, so I think we'll just we'll go ahead and beat the game, we'll restart, and uh... And swap back over to, to Luigi. So we can call one seed done at about 245, maybe a little bit less than 245. Which is pretty solid for a solo two way multi here. And we'll just have to find whatever items remain for Luigi. So it'll be a light source, hook shot. I think that's it at this point. Oh, another sword, actually, too, because we can't beat in with plastic. So, a few things. A few things we require still. But not too many. Not too many. Problem is, they could be anywhere that's accessible. <laughs> anywhere that's accessible at this point. Which is a lot of spots. three, of course not. That should be now. Okay. Just to make sure, though. Oh my goodness. Alright. <laughs> We'd rather not burn that fairy if we don't need to, but no big deal if we do. That's what it's there for. I don't think I can get, yeah. 
near a fairy. Oh wow, okay, so Mario Silvers are in. Luigi's uh, Pyramid Fairy, that kind of stinks, honestly. Oh, well, okay. Well, there's the fairy, at least. And we do have a blue potion, just in case things get serious. I think I was that close to him. Little bastard. Okay, cool. <laughs> Means we can uh, beat Mario's side here. And then get to work on Luigi since we got a lot of work to do over there. So, bonk. We'll let this play out for uh, credits wise and we'll pop back to look at the stats a little bit when it's ready. But for now. Luigi's turn. Alright, so what can Luigi do? A lot now. Both gloves. No, he doesn't have the lamp just yet, so we're gonna skip the Ega Tower climb. Just do our normal, mostly normal, uh, Dark World route here. Oh wait, uh, Skull Woods, we don't have Fire Rod. We can do the initial few. Small key as well. Right, we still have only the plastic sword for Luigi, fuck. Got spoiled by getting early, early red sword for Mario, that's for dang sure. Bastard. <laughs> Gonna get another heart when he signs back on. Well. Exciting to get that. Is there any way we can't get up there? Oh, we can get up there now. Yeah, we can go in the dark world up there for for whatever, right? Do we have the big key. We don't. So we got one more then in the back side. I suppose just for posterity's sake, we should check. Um, MSP over here. Although, how close are we on the credits there? Okay. A little bit to go yet. <laughs> of course, we don't have Samaria on this side either. Rito. T. 
Mighty Rock. Ooh. Uh, actually, wait, wait, wait. Let's go. Just for grins, let's go check MSP. Because if it is something important, that's going to be another... Probably like 30 minutes or so to do that shit. Oh, excuse me? Why didn't he die? He made the whole... Noise. Gas. Eh, no matter. Care. Oh boy, that's ether. Uh, that stinks. <laughs> uh, that really stinks. Ah, shit. It's gonna fuck up everything. All right, let me just uh, let me just remember that ether is on MSP for Luigi there. What are we doing? Okay, I've got to the credits on Mario there. Two. It's just I don't wanna miss I don't wanna miss the stats in Mario's side, so we'll we'll cut over to that when it's ready. We got up there. Three hundred bucks, sorry. Oh we don't give a shit about that. Credits. the stats for Mario. Both swords were pretty early for both Mario and Luigi. Late, late ass boots, early flute, early mirror, good, good, good. One plastic sword kill and the rest were bacon since we got two right away and forget where that was. Big key really doesn't apply, honestly. Then I accused two deaths, both of which, well, one of which was intentional, I believe. Pretty good. Got about a third, a little bit less than a third of the items left over there, just in case we need to get something for Luigi. But alright. Not bad. Not bad so far. Now, let's see, what are we missing? Lamp or fire rod, hook shot, whatever bosses, whatever items we need for bosses on the tower climb. Yeah. 
which we might want to actually check sooner rather than later. I guess we'll do the, our first sweep of Dark World here. So we have very little, very few uh, dungeons we can actually complete. Can't do Desert, can't do Eastern, can't do Swamp, can't do Pod, can't do Thieves Town. We could do Ice. We might do Ice before we do it. Uh, to climb up the mountain now. So we can at least complete that, more or less. And it's gonna look like another, possibly another early GT on this side, too. That's gonna be a lot of items. Although not very many, considering we don't have a fire source. Or Samaria, so right hand side is entirely out. Left hand side would be kind of a pain in the butt for that hidden path because we don't have a thing to light the torch. Uh, we'll have to make something happen, I guess. GT comes, great. Perfect, thanks. Alright, so we'll do the first four in Thieves, again. <laughs> uh, Mario's small key for desert. Woo! Well, it might be important if something is in the... In the backside of desert for Luigi, but... Oh, well, I can't do that anyways, because it doesn't have the, the big key, does it? Fast, all right. Well, we just got his little booty boots. The single rupees, all right. So popping into uh, Thieves Town was a smart idea. So it gives us the well, one of the last bits to Lumberjack Ledge. If we, in fact we need that big key, hopefully we won't. But who knows? King's Tomb. Gross. So we can go up and do Dark Side Death Mountain as well. I would like to put another crystal to Luigi's name here, just in case. We'll have to do that at Ice Palace. Actually, do we know what anything is? Alright, we know Thieves Town is the other 5 6 sir. T Rock is a normal crystal, and we know Skull is green. Yep, we knew that already. Okay, so. Hmm. Pretty even odds on ice being another crystal. So 
the island is another big key, but we can get that now. equipment to make pretty much all of these checks in one go. That makes me happy. Since Luigi was in BK mode for an hour and a half, <laughs> so happens that he picked up some stuff as Mario was doing his thing. Skullwoods for Mario. Woo oh, excuse me, sir. for anything for Mario at this point, unless it uh, unlocks places for him to check that Luigi's stuff might be at. At this point, is really just keys. Keys and a shovel for that fetch quest, honestly. Yeah, it's... Oh, uh, and, uh... Powder for Batman, I guess, too, huh? Okay, oh, no. Could still be useful. second sword to be able to get him. At least check it out. I really don't need any more health for Luigi here. Like, he, He's good. He's good to go. Wouldn't mind that red mail, but honestly we don't need any more raw health. There. Piece of candy. Alright. Bombos tablets out. Can even do most of. Well, we could do some of. Well, we could do most of Swamp actually, because we've got the hammer. We just don't have the hookshot to do back half. Do one, two, three, four, five, five, maybe six items. Do I have the big key for swap? I don't. Small key to pod, which is fine. Big key to finish it off. Jeez. <laughs> Finally, a shield. And the miter big key for Mario. Okay, well, it's, well something. Oh shoot, we didn't look in the 
In the credits roll, what was on MSP for Mario? Uh-oh. Probably should have checked that. Ah, oh, well. Alright, so what do we got left here? It's pretty much just... Okay, we should check Pyramid, actually. We can do Pyramid. Uh, I've only got three small keys for Pod. Should give us most things, actually. Pyramid, Catfish, and maybe do Ice and Head Up the Mountain, then? Big item number plays here. Two. Two to begin. Okay. That's fine. Um, hopefully Ice will be our second one. We can always get back to pod pretty easy. It's a quick go of things. Should probably do a quick check of Meyer Shed related areas too. That's a quick three-ish items, right? Dude, get the fuck out of my way. while. Because <laughs> we're really lacking a lot of keys to be able to finish crap here. Uh, well, we might still be- oh no, we can't do desert until we get a fucking fire source. That's disgusting. Any fire source would do at this point. Oh, Thieves Big Key. Okay. Small key to pod there. Thieves Big will get us uh, another guaranteed crystal, in fact. So if we do Ice and Thieves, it's Quack for Meyer, so we can't get in there. Key for Mario, gross. Uh, actually, no, we want to be out of there now, don't we? So we can't get into Mire at all. Uh, we could technically do a couple on Desert, but we're not gonna. Uh, let's ride back to Thieves. So we can now complete that. Give Give us a guaranteed another crystal, and also Pyramid Fairy, which will hide uh, Mario Silvers. Which we don't give a shit about, actually. But maybe there's something else in Luigi's Pyramid Fairy, too. I figured there was there's something we could use in there, perhaps. Not a guaranteed crystal. Depends on what the boss is, I suppose. We can't do Argus or, uh, or Trinex. <laughs> Those are the two missing. See any little glitchy room transition, so it's probably not a Trinex. Thank you. 
boy. That room is having a party. Oh, damn it. Actually, no, that's what I wanted, right? Yeah, 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 never mind. than anything else, but in case it is a vanilla blind, that is required. Derp. Forget that. That was important. It wasn't. But hey, just in case it was. question. Uh, it's a Vitreus. That's gonna be uh, not too bad, considering how many arrows we've got. Ow. I think it's three arrows per tiny eye? Yeah. Town secondary crystal. Which is good. That'll be the second red crystal, so that's opens pyramid fairy. I think we'll just to move on down to ice first. So maybe pick up a third crystal. Just to kind of guarantee what we need to do here. So that shouldn't be too difficult. Hopefully it's a boss we can beat. If not, that'll be a kind of a waste of time. It'll have to be a Bombos. I think we got half magic. Okay, Bombos only Ice Palace, which is kind of gross, but... Mm. I'd rather do this and be prepared with another crystal later than, uh... Go up to GT and be like, sorry, you need to a crystal. Which, at this point, we're at a 60% chance of being able to get in. Which, you know... A heart and a map. Okay, so we don't need to do the two left chests in Swamp. That's good. Their biggest pain in the butt to get to, but we know there's no, they're no longer required.
single ass rupee there. I don't know which one that is. For Mario, but that's the first or second one for him. Oh wow, this is a mess of a fucking room. But we only need to do it once. <laughs> Gross. Oh no. Ow. Oof. Excuse me. Arcade beetles. Damn. It's a rough ass room. Here. Hey. Yeah. Small key to visit pass can be found in Misery Mire. Oh boy. Okay. Need to go into. Need to go into. Wait. That's a swamp or desert? Desert. Okay. Sorry. Desert small. Misery Mire on Mario's side there. That's, uh, ugh. That's kind of gross, but whatever. Hopefully we don't need to worry about it. Right, I think Luigi, Luigi's shadow is normal for this, so shouldn't be too bad. All those fuck faces. Alright, a hook shot. So, probably even better that we're doing it this route. Try to eyeball the second bomb jump. If we do need to reconnect with Mario, he's gonna have a pile of shit waiting for him. Just hoping we don't have to, but it could be a while before we find that out for sure. Alright, that's all the loose ones there. Sound big, gross. Huh. Right, so 
actually not just the boss that I hope we can beat. It's not guaranteed just yet. I think Argus and Trinex are probably the only two. Although, any boss really on ice here with only Fighter Sword is going to be mm, less than good. This guy has been bothering me while I'm doing the rest of this. Alright. Let's see if it's something... Passable. Ah, uh, okay, so another Helma. That's fine. That's easy enough. Take away the ice wings, too. Hooray. Actually, no. There were never ice physics in the actual Cold Stair fight, was there? I don't remember now. I don't think so. I think it was just the second refight in G Tower that was ice physics. Let's hope this is another crystal which will give us three out of four, eh? Another bottle isn't too bad, I guess. Hooray! Okay. Okay, good. So now 80% chance of being able to get into the tower. Here's hoping. I guess we'll, uh, I suppose we'll do, um, Pyramid Fairy first, though. Be a good idea. That's at least going to be Mario's silvers in case he needs them, and then uh, whatever else the second item is. Which may or may not be important, but hey, just in case, do all those things that we possibly can do here. I had the hook shot and could beat Swamp, I would do Swamp right away too. For that chance at four crystals and a guaranteed G Tower entrance, but mm, oh well. Kind of hedge on the 80% and hope for the best. Shot at a good item. Ah! Well, even better. Second sword is uh, something to cross off there. I'll take it. I prefer a third one at the very least if we're gonna have to do silverless on both sides here, but. step closer, which in fact we may well do, uh, may well do Spike Cave first here, just in case that's another sword or some garbage. So that's definitely a thing that could happen. I think we've got a hint for Luigi's Spike Cave either. So we're just gonna go, just gonna go do it. See what it is. I have the hook shot here. That's fine. Oh, we almost have enough health just to do this straight out. And we do have enough health just to do it straight out. <laughs> the other castle tower small. Not that it matters. 
Not that it matters, we're not doing fucking Mega 1 on Mario's side anyways. to do G Tower. It's gonna depend on the... It's gonna depend most on the boss refights on the climb as to whether or not we'll be able to beat the tower. Of course, that's assuming we can even get in there, too. Uh, can we do... We already did Tower Para, right? We can't get that last item because we don't have a fire source yet. It's so gross. Oh, right! We can't even do the climb without a fire source. Never mind. But I guess we're up here. Oh, jeez. We're up here mostly for the sake of, uh... Actually, I'm gonna just do it the other way. Up here mostly for the sake of checking out what bosses are on the climb. Or, well, actually, can we, we can't even get to any of the bosses, can we? Yeah, never mind. But I guess we can get into the tower and that's gonna be a lot of... A lot of item checks. Can't do right side without some Mario or Fire Source. We can do left side, which is like a good... 8 or 9, I think. So that might be worth it. Might be worth it regardless. I'm not assuming the tower isn't four crystals to get into, which, you know, 20% chance that it could be that. <laughs> Mario's fetch quest, gross. Not a pod. Small, so okay, that's... Gotta be getting close to full pod keys for Mario there. Gotta be getting close. Alright, we can't even do, uh... Most of Bookshot Cave. Got their quack for, uh... T-Rock as well, huh? That's fine, we can backdoor T-Rock if needed. Oh, excuse me. anything. I know there was a big key up here on the... On the floating island. There are a very large deficit of big keys here, so please at least have it be something useful. on this side. Yeah, it's pretty useful. Two items at the very least, right? So we might backdoor T-Rock just to get as many as we can here. Three is three enough? Three is not enough. It's the full four. Ah, oh, that's gross. That's kind of gross. All right. Uh, I guess, I guess pod. Can you do swamp? Do skull, did ice, can't do T-Rock. We'd have to do, I think pod would have to be the one here. Pod or desert. Oh wait, we can't do desert because we don't have a fire source. <laughs> uh, it's so gross. All right, well, let's back to our T-Rock and see what we can see whilst we're up here. Not gonna be able to see much. Unfortunately, but uh, we don't have some Mario, so we can't get across there. We'd have to go in here. Oh, that's that's even worse somehow. You. Oh, can we even do this? Actually, can I open this? I think I can open this, right? Ah. <laughs> All right. Let's just kind of wiggle our way out there. That's kind of weird. That's right. I always forget that we can't. Can't really do much about that. Uh, 
All right, we do have all the loose T-Rock keys right now. Okay, so we should grab this one in the center. Not like it's gonna matter. Uh, well, we're not gonna be able to do much here. We'll have to do just kind of the approach. We have to be the all just the approach one-off chests, really. Because we don't have Samaria or the Fire Rod to do the rest. It's so bad. Uh, okay, let's just go back this way. This will be the least lucrative T-Rock backdoor I've ever done. So there's one. I'll be able to get two more, I think. Maybe not even two more. Maybe just one more, actually. It's this one on the way through. Uh, and then what? And then what should we do? I guess we can go to... Can't really, we can do one in Swamp. It's kind of gross. We might just start tossing hints out there, actually. We're approaching three and a half hours. We really only need a couple things for Luigi here, so it's not really... Not really even that much. Last item I can get here. Yeah, because I don't have the I don't have the big key. Uh I suppose technically I can do mimic cave. Totally out of logic. But hey, we'll do it. Not much. I guess we can go down and do pod. Pod would still be the the good thing to do. Plus we can get the get hopefully what is going to be a crystal out of pod. Uh, there's one in desert we can grab as well. I think it's just the big the big chest. Oh, and the torch, I suppose, right? That's easy to pop in for. And that'll lock me out of there. Technically, and grab the grab the small key, so it'll be a couple more. Or did we already do this? Uh, did we already? S oh no, we couldn't have because we didn't have the gloves to get back here to do this. I don't think, right? Yeah. Let's go ahead and grab that. So that'll give us one, two, three more. At this point, I think the most helpful item would be a fire rod. Fire rod and another crystal so we can get up from the G Tower, right? Fire rod would open a whole lot of whole lot of stuff. Is there anything on the torch here? Oh, right! Luigi's powder. Okay, so that's there's Batman. Oh no, that was Mario's powder. Okay, so there's Mario's Batman. <laughs> Damn it. That's right. Oh, we already got this. Okay, right. Guess that makes sense. Yeah, I guess that makes the, the item count come up correctly. Desert for a bit. That's a burrito. Good lord. Okay. Uh, that one's kind of bogus. All right. Um, I guess we'll head on over to Pod then. I'm a whole bunch of sugar. <laughs> you know, whatever helps helps him get the job done. You know, right? Gonna. Get all down on them for for their habits. They're not hurting anybody else. 
All right, so pod, we've got three smalls and the big, so we should, let's see. We can avoid one by skipping the front door. Yeah, I think we should be all right. We should be able to get most of, most of the back half. Let's skip Harmless Hellway. Yeah. Let's skip Harmless Hellway, we'll do the two in the back, and then save the last one for the boss approach. And hope that this is another crystal. So then we can go back up to G Tower. Even if we can't complete it without a hookshot and a fire sword. This is so lame. Three and a half hours in, we don't have a fire source for Luigi. Poor dude's just gonna be in the dark forever. And if nothing comes of ah, nothing comes with our hopefully G Tower dip here coming up. In a few minutes, we'll probably just start tossing hints and seeing where the remainder of uh, Luigi's necessary gear is. It's really, it's down to Hookshot and Fire Source. I wouldn't say no to another sword, too, but yeah, we can. So we can strictly get by without it. Yeah. Speaking of which, there's the fire source, so now we're down to hookshot. Excellent. here and complete pod. I guess we can when we do go back up to G Tower now we can do the climb and see the the boss refights. There'll be one more one more bit of information we'll have. Oh shit, this'll be uh crap. Ugh, I might look up a <laughs> I might look up a map for this one because I hate it. Honestly, I honestly hate this dark maze. Cause I don't... I have a general feeling on how this works. But not much of one. Cause I don't really know where I am now. <laughs> okay, this might be the corner. It is. Nice. Okay. Um... Ow. Bitch. That? All right. I don't. Oh, no, that's gonna take me back out the door. Uh, get out of my way, you fucker! Where are you? There you are, bitch. Okay. I gotta go up and around. No. I think that's that's mostly correct here. We want to go down, up and around. No. Uh, I might just look up the map for this because I I think I'm a little lost now. Oh, maybe not. Excuse me, sir. Okay, I think I know where I am now. Come back down here, there we go. Okay. There's the T-Rock big key. Oh, that's kind of gross. <laughs> Alright, well now we're set to, uh... to go back up there, at least. 
Now this is gonna be... Um, actually, hold on a second, I... I don't think I'm against the wall. Go back down. Actually don't know where I am. Oh, no, there it is. Okay, so we kind of bumbled our way through that. <laughs> so I forgot I didn't have the lamp. Oops. All right, now we just got to bumble our way back around. Uh, down there. Okay, I think we need to go back up along the corner here, right? Back down, up and around. Yep, that tracks a little bit, I think. Okay, we're almost there. Okay, we might be there. Boy, that was a fucking. <laughs> Oh, I don't like that dark room. That's still better than the Ega Tower dark room, but Jesus, that one's not fun either. Ah, this one's easier though. Well, maybe. It's there. Dark rooms were a bust. Oh, we're gonna have to do the second half. Dark rooms is gonna be interesting. I guess we do have the fire rod, so we can use that to make it a lot easier. It's gonna be a matter of getting there. Dark rooms, I'm less confident in. Okay. There we go, that's better. <laughs> Maybe those aren't so bad. Like, after doing the dark maze, that one's actually pretty easy. Alright, this is the boss we can beat. Looks like it's a land mouse, so yes. Is that going to have been worth it, however? Yes, it was. Excellent. Now we can go back up to GT. We can do most of the climb, except the very end. Oops. My tracker just crashed there. Oopsie. Uh. <laughs> Ruh-roh. 
I'm gonna restart that real quick. Hopefully it will pull back most of the data. I hope. There we go. <laughs> The exception of shit we checked and didn't uh, really care for, right? Bottle vendor. Uh, library, I believe, was nothing, right? Yeah. I don't know if we did Bombos. We did Desert Ledge for sure. Oh, we did Bombos Tablet. We did Lake Hylia Island. The game was garbage. Okay, that should be fine. Um, did that pop back properly? Yes, it did. Good. Okay, well that's a little scary. <laughs> okay, uh, back up to uh, G Tower, methinks. <coughs> so we can gain some knowledge and hopefully our hook shot. Bombos tablet? I think we did Bombos. No, no, maybe we didn't. We didn't. I don't remember now. I think I did. So I couldn't. I, oh, I must have been able to check it, but I couldn't actually do it because I didn't have Master Sword at the time, so I think it was garbage. I know Lumberjack was something. Ether was on pedestal. Yeah, alright. We should be fine. I hope we're fine anyways. I know there was one more... One more big key. I think that was just desert. No, it wasn't desert torch. Was um... right. It's lumberjack ledge had the big key. That hopefully at this point won't be important. So I don't want to have to do Ega one. Be stupid. For the time being, we'll do as much of G Tower as we can. Can't do right side again without. Uh, without Samaria, so that's kind of locked out, but we should be able to do Lion's Share of left side and then most of the climb. And who knows, maybe we'll hit our hookshot on, uh, on one of those. Be quite helpful. Alright, so Luigi's side was definitely kind of garbo. Four on the tower, and I think three... Again, I'm here. So we're good to go there. It's a big damn shame that we can't get across the uh, bookshot area there. If we, well, we, if we knew how and we had the execution to do the hover, we could just kind of skip everything else. But unfortunately, I don't have that expertise. <laughs> That's what I think. 30 hertz mashing, right? With the Dash button, and then crossing again. I don't know. It's kind of wild. Whatever it is, it's kind of wild. I don't feel like destroying my fingers and or thumbs to, to try it out. Fire small is less than helpful. Just the yeah, I suppose I should be able to, right? Yeah. Uh oh, I might need to do a bomb jump for this one though. God, I hate yeah, I hate doing this, but we got plenty of bombs and plenty of health, so it doesn't matter really. Ow. Up here. Well, there's my ice rod, so that 
ensures me against a Trinex boss, at least. Kind of gross, but whatever. Now, oh, you little bitch, Beemos. Come on. <laughs> hey, hole. Single rupee, this run is mostly valid. bomb jump this too. This one's a little bit fiddly. I don't know that I can... Ah, eh, maybe that's not so bad. Oh god, what is the big key? Oh, that's the Meyer big key. Uh, well, it doesn't matter. We don't have Quake. Quake, so no Meyer, and no uh, Samaria, so no Meyer completion at the very least. What do we got there? Ice Palace big, I don't care. Well, there's Quake. Shit. <laughs> Shit. I don't think I need Samaria to beat T Rock, do I? I just need it for the front half. Oh no. No, there would be dark rooms and shit yet, right? Okay, yeah, we still need some Arya for, for T Rock, never mind. But we can do most of Meyer now! That fucking sucks. <laughs> Finish off Desert if we really need to, which hopefully we don't need to. I guess before we leave, um. Before we leave G Tower, I'll just hint out where Luigi's hookshot is, considering it could be almost literally anywhere. We're approaching four hours here, so we can make this less painful for ourselves. We do the remaining checks up here that we care about. Ah, oh, crap! It's an Argus, I can't even do this. <laughs> okay, alright, forget it then. Let's just hint out that hookshot. Desert Palace, Big Chest, and Mario's World. Okay, well, looks like we're getting Mario back in here. <laughs> um. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. I'm okay with using a single ass, single ass hint as the mood strikes, but do we have the Desert Palace Big Key? Ooh, that's gonna be a question mark. We'll have to wait for all this to roll through. I hope that the Desert Palace big key is in there. There's the Desert Small, so that's something. Air big key, gross. Rock big key, damn it. We're gonna just gonna, gonna have to hint out the desert palace big key here too. Unless Damn it, Thieves Town big, silvers of course naturally, right? Okay. 
kind of slim that we're going to get the Desert Palace big key out of this, huh? Damn it. Alright, fuck it. <laughs> Where the fuck is the Desert Palace big key, then? Oh, that's the fucking lumberjack tree. Oh, that's so stupid. Okay. So, gotta do egg one over on Luigi. Well, where the fuck is Luigi's lamp? <laughs> fucking hell, I'm not doing egg one Misery Mire big chest. Okay, oh, big key chest in Misery Mire in Mario's world. Okay. All right. So, I'm not doing the egg tower climb without the lamp. And I need to do the Ega Tower climb to get the Desert Palace big key for Mario, which holds the, um, which holds Luigi's big key chest, right? Which holds Luigi's hookshot. God damn. What a stupid chain of events. But hey, whatever, we'll just do it. Can get into Meyer, right? Yeah, it's Bombos. Good. Alright, I guess while we're looking for things, then, can we find another sword for Luigi, too? Skull Woods big chest in Mario's world. Can we get that? We cannot. How about a different one? It's a Hostrela. Oh, that's so gross. Both of those are. Disgusting. Skullwood's big chest or turn in green pendant. Ugh. Which, I mean, I guess I can do just by uh, completing Mire here, which might actually be worthwhile. Alright, so big key chest, right? Big key chest for the lamp. Just gonna be the cutscene. Oh, it's the cutscene chest. That's right. Ugh, gross. Alright, so I mean, aside from this final dumb chain of items, both these seeds have been pretty alright. Oh crap, I don't have enough for uh... Okay, good. I was like, uh, oh, please tell me I've got enough time to do that. curious what the full chain to get this lamp was supposed to be then, because I don't know where where we found the requirements to get into Meyer. But here's Luigi's lamp, right? Okay, that's something. I'm gonna go ahead and polish off Meyer then to get the green pendant. So then I can get another sword for Luigi and he'll be good for offense. Now I gotta go over to Ega Tower, on Luigi's side, beat Ega 1, kick down the Lumberjack tree for, uh, the big key to desert for Mario, so that Mario can go to desert, open the big chest, and get Luigi's hookshot. <laughs> what a dumb chain. What a dummy chain to follow, but hey, whatever. Better to just find out about it. We're already knocking on four hours here. Better just find out about it, do the chain, and, and be done. 
because while this is fun, I like it's always usually late seed stuff that gets kind of annoying. off any of the items from Meyer. Did take that off. Alright, that's fine. Alright, let's go get Luigi's sword. <laughs> That's on Lu Oh, that's Luigi's green pendant turn in. Oh, that fucking sucks. Shit. I did the wrong pendant turn in, so that was a waste of time. Uh, oh, that stinks. Now we had two there. No, this is an Argus. Ugh, crap. We definitely don't have the green pendant on Luigi's side. Do we know where that is? Okay, great. Yeah, there's that. Uh, feeling we know where the green pendant is, but I don't. Uh, it's Skull Woods. Um, could technically do Skull Woods, but now I need to go over to right Mega Tower. Ugh. Come on, keep up. Would be a pretty well. We may not even be able to do it actually, because if it's another Argus in Skull Woods, then we're we're fucked. <laughs> we don't have the hook shot yet. Uh, I have only my, myself to blame for this. Hoping I could get through this entire thing without using my hands, but well, better this way than, than the alternative.
be the dark maze in this so much as it is the uh, dark narrow passage. Or dark narrow uh, walkways that would kill me. Well, maybe not kill me. Just annoy me so much that I would probably rage quit. <laughs> so, that's why we detoured for lamp. Because uh, this room fucking sucks in the dark. I thought this room was in the dark as well, but I'm glad it wasn't. Not that it matters now, anyways. Anyway, as soon as we saw that big key on Lumberjack Ledge, like three minutes in, I knew in my heart that this was going to be a pain in the ass. Three for three on the blue balls? Why not? Suck my ass. Alright, cool. murdered get over to the lumberjack tree we get the desert palace big key for Mario so we can get the hook shot for Luigi good gravy what a dumb chain Successfully traded another day of your life for currency. <laughs> well, that's good, I guess. Well, maybe not good. That's necessary in most cases, so congratulations on making it through the day successfully. Because boy howdy, some days are harder than others, aren't they? Alright, there's the Desert Palace big key. Mario! Ugh. Let's get Luigi back up to G Tower. Oh god, this is gonna be Spin Strat Silverless for Luigi. Oh, that's fucking gross. Maybe I can at least find Silver Arrows for him. To make this less of a garbage fire.
<coughs> oh, goodness, excuse me. Ugh. item check that Mario needs to do. Well, I guess that depends. Okay, I'm gonna look up silvers for for Luigi, because you know what? I can do silverless Ganon, I can do spin strats Ganon, but be damned if I want to do both. Because <laughs> I really don't want to do both. Alright, Luigi took a shot. that particular one, so where's Bo Alt. Turtle Rock boss in Mario's world. Nope, not happening. So I guess we're doing Spin Strat Silverless. <laughs> Damn it. Oh, gross. Ugh. Ah, well. We have uh, we might be pitching out for some potions as well. <laughs> Oi. I could do a forfeit on Mario, that's true. That might give me at least one sword. But, nah. <laughs> I guess I need the practice with it anyways. Event. Actually, was one of the swords on Mario's side? No, because it was... No, I don't think that would help anyways. Oh no, it, it would give Luigi the silvers. Ah, that feels bad. I'm not going to do a forfeit. <laughs> Despite the fact that I did finish on Mario's side, it wouldn't feel that bad, but... Yeah, I'd just prefer not to. Whatever, it's fine. It makes the Ganon fight more exciting. Something like that. Thank <laughs> you. 
Ooh, easy. I mean, I guess I've already kind of cracked the seal by using hints anyways, but meh. Don't mind the last six minutes or so that we're going to be doing this. These two refights are going to be kind of a pain in the ass, given our abysmal damage output. Samaria. <laughs> That's annoying. soft lock like a big dummy. I don't think there's anything at this point that'll help us out besides, like, red mail, I guess. Ugh, for babies for a shield, alright. I guess another bottle, but even so we'll have blue potions for the cannon fight, that'll be enough. Oh! because of the dumb arena. Oh shit! I don't have a fairy, do I? Fuck! <laughs> oh, balls, we're gonna have to do the climb again. Damn it! Oh, I'm such an idiot. Uh, crap. Grumble. Grumble, grumble. Cold stair fight goes extra quick, does that make it a cold escalator? Oh my goodness. Yes! <laughs> I suppose. 
That logic tracks. Alright. Do our best to get a ferry on the way up here. There's that pit stop room we could stop in, I guess. <laughs> right there. Damn it, mother... Okay. Although, are there any fairies in here? Oh, there are. Oh, there is. Okay. Uh, I don't have a net. Shit. <laughs> Never mind. We cannot get fairies, because I'm an idiot, apparently. Alright, so we'll just preferably go in with the uh, maximized health and hope for the best. fight again. Oh well. Playing a Pokemon mod for RimWorld, now your Magnemite has dementia. <laughs> Jeez. Oh boy. Well, that poor Magnemite. Lesson from the first time. <laughs> Dope. the fucking... Oh, wait. Didn't need to do that. <laughs> All right. Uh, yeah. Okay. This time we're just gonna whip out the fire rod because, uh... <clears throat> fuck doing that climb a third time. for Luigi's more bombs. Hooray! Okay. Mm 
All right, let's get Pickle. Easy egg a two fight, then we'll bop out for some potions and <sighs> do stupid spin silverless. Gross. Uh, I don't know if I got a triple in there. Pretty sick if I did. Ow. Oh, you little jackasses. Okay, great. Good at geometry. <laughs> nice. Okay, I think that counted as three. Okay, all right. All right, I get two. Fucker. We had okay. Uh, B. All right, so we got three bottles. That should be hopefully more than enough. That should be plenty to do this, especially since we've got half magic. Probably be more worried about health than I am about magic power, but we'll see. Let's see how this goes. It's gonna be a stupidly long fight. Only Master Sword, of course, but... Oh, well! Oh, right. Got the thing here. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Whew. skated by on that one. I think, right? There we go. Ah, you little dodgy bastard. Come on. Okay, fuck face. Come on. Thank you.
bounty that we get. Find the silver arrows with try and No, I did not. In fact, I did not. Okay. Oh, shit. That's right. Hey, little bitch. Such a dumb fight. I hate it. I don't think I'm gonna get a third out of that. Ugh. Hate how long this takes, Master Sword. Ow! Little bitch. Easy, buddy. Make this even longer by falling down. Thank you. My goodness. Alright. Well, I'll make it out at about the four and a half hour mark. <laughs> did it. Alright. Let the credits roll for the second time. <laughs> Phew. Okay. Well, again, not too terribly bad until that last dumb chain of bullshit to get Luigi's hook shot. Oof. Oof, 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 oof. That was fun, though. I like to do these every now and again. Maybe one day. Oh, goodness. Maybe one day I'll work up the, uh, the courage to do a three-way multi <laughs> solo. Good lord, that would take probably a good seven hours, considering. Although we could always dial back the randomness on it. And make it like no crystals, Ganon rush, and do whatever. Do whatever to shorten it up, because that would be a long a lot of time to be spending on one particular game. <sighs> uh, but alright, so not too bad. Even capping the crystals at four, Luigi's side had a 4-3 on it. Four to get into the tower, three to get to Ganon. And then Mario's side wasn't too bad with three to get to the tower and one to get to Ganon. Still had to hit the, the upper portion of those crystal counts. Items were relatively good until the final stretch there. Overall, I don't think it was too bad. But it could always be better. I knew what my hotkey was for speeding emulation speed along here, but 
I guess we'll just wait it out. I can actually see what is going to be MSP here. Or did we already know what MSP was on Luigi's side? We did one of them, but not the other. Oh, I think it was Mario's that we didn't know about. I think Luigi's was kind of garbage. Just money or so, I think. I suppose I can check what Mario's was. Uh, here. It was just, uh, oh no, Lumberjack Tree was bombed. We already knew that and didn't care. Um, shit, this is the wrong one. Hit location, uh, what's that? Master Sword Pedestal, right? Okay, it's just an arrow upgrade on Mario's side. Good. Not that it matters, it wasn't anything important, but just really curious about it usually. The old man is made of snakes this time. Ah, right. Ether on MSP for Luigi. That's right. I forgot it was something sort of maybe important. Luckily, it ended up not being important. Actually, it might have been Mario's uh, ether. Uh, I already closed my hint thing. Oh well. these folks think about this like if 20 some years later they knew that this game would be internet enabled sort of <laughs> right that it would be revived and played as much as it is for for randos and shit that's pretty cool though like that's so neat that that's a possibility a lot of very smart people made the original game and a lot of very smart people made the randomizer work for it, so. Good job, everybody. Hmm. Frankenstein into a thing of beauty, yeah. No, no kidding, right? wild some of the stuff that's possible and some of the stuff that people have already done <laughs> Maybe someday for entrance rando. Maybe someday. Enemy rando is fun though. If a little bit annoying in dark rooms. sword that Luigi carried through forever. Super late boots, um, middling flute, pretty early mirror. 
shitty ass master sword finish. <laughs> okay. Only two of those six deaths was accidental. Maybe. About 152. I think that was pretty close on Mario's side, too. That particular collection rate. And aside from prior to going back for some of Luigi's crap. Hey, you know, four and a half hours, pretty much flat. Not bad for two kind of gnarly seeds. Whew! All right. Well, that'll do it for tonight. Next stream will be tomorrow, I guess. Tech yeah, it's technically still tomorrow. Uh, question mark PM CST. The grab bag. We'll pick something. We'll probably revisit something. I think. Maybe we'll do more BPM. BPM was a fun game. So that's tomorrow, question mark PM CST. Um, and then Sunday, 7 PM CST, it'll be long play, it'll be going back to Spelunky 2 again for more cool stuff, miscellaneous stuff, again. Maybe try more eggplant runs or something. But that'll do it for tonight, thanks for watching everybody. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye.